Yo, what? I'm recording already. Okay, I guess we'll start. Okay, so what's up? Uh, my name is Royal, and today I'll show you how to do manga shakes. So I have to really quick prepare my clips because right now they're pretty mid. Yeah, okay, so now we have this. I'm just gonna pre-compose them. We're gonna pretend that this is a manga panel like this. I'm gonna show you how to do a manga shake. So first I'm gonna add a little like transition sort of because uh, shakes doesn't look good without the transition. So we have to do a little zoom out maybe. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, maybe something like this. So now we have this and now we're gonna apply my shake. So the thing is I press new, then adjustment layer. I add it and I cut it somewhere right here, right? I add Twixter, what am I saying? I add Twitch, uh, then I keyframe it. I put 100 uh, in the very first, I don't know. But yeah, I put 100 uh, right right here at, uh, at the start of the adjustment layer. Yeah, finally got it. And I put this uh, at the very end uh, as zero. Now we easy ease, then we go here, then we uh, press value graph, bam bam. Then you do this, you make it as sharp as possible, so it's like... You can cut yourself with this, it's sharp as that. Then you change the speed from 5 to 10. And now the fun part, where the shake begins, is when we press enable and we press slide and light. Oh, slide doesn't work. And what I like to do is go on light and increase it a little bit, so it's like a quick flash, you know? So now we have this shake. It's really, it's really good. Oh yes, look at this. It's so smooth, right? If your clip looks a little too stiff, there's no movement or whatever, you can add twitch. And you can do the reverse order, so like 100 there and 0 here. Easy, easy. do sharp graph like this. Make this a 10 and enable slide and light. Also increase a little bit of light. And now you have this really cool transition i don't know you can use it for certain scenes but in my case it's not really working so i'm just gonna duplicate this and bam and also because it's a zoom out clip i obviously add my optics compensation optics compensation right here zero 100 it's just what i do you i showed you the shakes already so yeah that's what i do and i duplicate it i put this here yeah, and that's basically it. That's my um, shake for manga panels, for manga edits. They're really clean, um, pretty good. These shakes are really good. I use them every time. Really useful. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out.